Good day, Craig Meister here, coming to you on Sunday, October 1st, in the year of our Lord, 2023, from Fayetteville, Arkansas, at the New Narnia Fair. This is a host of Royals. Hello! Hello. Salutations, friends. It's wonderful to meet you. What can one expect to find at the Narnia Fair? Well, when you come through the wardrobe and you enter our fairgrounds, we have a host of vendors as well as characters to meet. Um, my siblings and I, of course, um, as well as characters such as Prince Corin and King Loon and all sorts of unique ones to fair as well. Um, we have many quests that you can embark on. You go to the quest booth and you get a quest card. And depending on what characters you meet, what tasks you perform, you will get stamps which you can redeem at a market, all of which is completely free with your entry fee. There is also, of course, tea with the queens, dance lessons with the royals, uh, training to become a knight with my dear brothers, and so many more things. There's just a lot of fun interactions and all sorts of wonderful things that are truly unique just to Narnia. Huzzah! Very good. I, uh, I was mentioning earlier that I admired your quest, the different kinds of quests people can go on, so just going from booth to booth, getting a stamp, before they can go be knighted or made a, a lady of the realm. It's very open-ended. So if you have, what is it they call it, the ADHDs, and you should go all over the place, <laughs> you can still complete quests and not feel left out, or you have to complete required things that require time. Indeed, <laughs> yes. And uh, the, the many, there are many different styles of quests, so it may have you are not comfortable doing one that requires a lot of motion, a lot of running around, Indeed. such as one of the quests is complete night training. Perhaps you are not quite comfortable with that. But there are plenty of quests that you can do without much movement. Or if you want to run around there, let you despise sitting still and having a conversation with someone. There are plenty where you can go around and interact with as few people as you need. Indeed. <laughs> Very nice. And what was the inspiration for the start of this fair last year? Really just, there's things for other franchises, um, but there was really nothing for Narnia. There's things for all, all sorts of different fandoms, if you will, but I searched and searched and I couldn't really find anything for Narnia, so we reached out and we were we are a bunch of Renaissance fair people here, and I asked, uh, well I didn't ask, uh, my, my dear colleague did, uh, about the possibility of an Narnia fair. And they sent, after a bit of back and forth, they sent us the permission, and we both created this festival. I want uh, to be clear, it's not just the colleague's permission. Uh, our lovely dear sister Susan and the Dryad will have acquired the actual licensing rights from the C.S. Lewis Foundation. They are dynamos indeed. in the heart of this festival. Indeed. We are fully licensed and fully sanctioned, so all the copyright is in the Um and we sort of put it together. Um, we have a wonderful cast who are so passionate about the books and about Narnia. And we have wonderful vendors who are equally as passionate. And it's just been a wonderful, wonderful time. This is a family friendly event. We take the smallest child to the oldest child, and they have children of their own. Ah, uh -huh. indeed. Very good. And it is a three-day event as well? As well at present, yes. We are a, a three-day event, um, possibly more in the future, but for what we can see now, Hi. one weekend, uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Are the Fridays focused just on schools to bring in children, or can adults come? Anyone can come There's on no Fridays. There's no special predilection yet, but we are always welcome to acquire as many new patrons and visitors as possible. Indeed, ah. indeed, yes. And we do have group rates for large groups that wish, wish to come. Ah. Um, and as the three days move, we do move a bit to the story as well. So there, it is a different festival each day, which is very fun. So, ah. On the first day, Friday, it has been a year since the defeat of the witch. We are celebrating her defeat. On day two, it is a great festival because King Loon of Arkenland, the son Corin, and uh, Prince Rabadash on some years come and visit us. And it is a great building of relations between countries. And on day three, that is today, and between day one and day two, there is a 13-year time jump. And day oh, on day three, there is a one-year time jump between day two and three. And that is that the white stag has been sighted today. And so in just a bit, I believe we shall be going to look for the white stag. I hope if you catch it, you get a wish. You get a wish, you catch oh. it. So we, we do hope to catch the white stag today. That's all good luck. Thank you. And we are in, is it Gully Park? Is that Gully pronounced correct? Yes. Very good, and Fayetteville. Very good. And do you look to have it in 2024 near the same time of year? 
We do hope so.、Um, of course, all things are dependent on venue and time and sort of things. This is volunteer run, so it is completely dependent on our volunteers. It is completely dependent on our schedulers and our、um, organizers as well. But as for the moment, yes, we do hope to have it again, same time of year, 2024. Huzzah! And where can people go for updates and information on the fair? You can go to our website, which is thenarniafair.com. Fair spelled with an e, or to any of our social medias. Faces.、Okay. The book of faces. The book of faces. The Instagram. We do not have the tweeting bird app, but any any of those、uh, for updates and information. And you can also email us at thenarniafair at gmail.com. Thank you. Very good. Do you, does anyone have anything to add? I look forward to seeing. Everyone who sees this video at our fair next year,、Indeed、I、so. hope that you shall be paying attention for our missives. And if you would like to help participate in any way, please reach out to our aforementioned sites and locations to see how you may be involved if you wish to volunteer. Indeed, yes. Very good. Volunteers are important. They make all festivals work. Indeed, indeed. So, especially, especially this one. As I said, we are completely volunteer run. There is not a college. There is not a、uh, organization that is behind us. We are us, so it is volunteers that make us us. Huzzah! Good work. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank you for your interview. We appreciate、yes. it. You're very welcome. Embassy for your time and for putting on this event. Of course. Thank you. Hi. You're welcome.